guys, it's Tanya here. Thanks for watching. So today I am filming my January Ipsy bag. Look what's back. I saw the shiny packaging when Logan came in the door with it the other day and I was like, yay! So that's fantastical. I have not opened this yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. I didn't even peek at this one really online. I say really because I kind of did a little bit, but not a lot, just a little bit. I have looked at other people's unbaggings of their Ipsy bag this month, but I hadn't done mine. So first thing is the card and it says, Fresh Start by Ipsy. And it's got all these cute little girls making faces that I really like. And then on the back, in case you didn't know, if you snap a pic of your January glam bag, you can actually tag it and you can win a one year subscription. So that's kind of cool. The bag this month has got a blue front, a white back, and an orange zipper. I actually kind of like it. It's all color blocked, which I really, really, really like. And then let's go through the products. I'm just gonna dump them all out. Normally I just pull them out of the bag, but today I'm just like, eh, let's just dump them all out. One, two, three, four, five. Five products. I already see one thing that I love. This is the Malin and Gotez Mojito Lip Balm. I already have one of these, so I'm not going to actually open this one because it's got like a over package. But I got one of these in a glossy box once and I absolutely love it. This is a full size. You guys know how much I love the Lippy Balm and I love, love, love this one. Great texture, great scent, beautiful. The next thing I got is the Nourish Organic Renewing Eye Cream in Avocado and Argan. Avocado is amazing for your eyes. This is also for normal to dry skin, which is what I have. This is a really nice size eye cream sample, actually. It's almost, it looks like it's probably a full size. I really like that. It, um, it really nourishes and hydrates that under eye area, so I'm excited to try this. And again, look at the size on that. Like It's, almost, it's bigger than the lip balm. I like that. Next, we got an eyeshadow brush from Elizabeth Mott. I love that it's pink. Oh my god, that's the cutest thing ever. They say don't mess with this ridiculously soft brush. I wouldn't say that it's ridiculously soft. I mean, it is pretty soft, actually. And it's like a flat packer brush. I love that it's got like the pink tips. I love that and I hate that. I love looking at it because it's so pretty, but I don't like it because it's hard to tell when it's actually clean, especially with like the look I'm doing today where I'm wearing the purple eyes. But it's a really good brush and I like that it's pink. Next product is the Belle Pierre Cosmetics Loose Powder in the color Excite. And this I'm assuming is a shimmery shimmery white just by looking at it. Ooh, can you guys see that? That's stunning. Ooh. I'm gonna build it up so you guys can see. I really actually am coming into my own with loose pigments. I was never really a fan and I used to find them super messy and a pain in the butt to deal with. But the more I get them in bags, the more I realize how gorgeously pigmented they are. I'm gonna just apply a little bit of that. And then I'm gonna blend it. You guys see that shimmer there? Ah! You can use it on your eyes as well. And then the last thing we got is a Pacifica Natural Mineral, Mineral Coconut Eyeshadow in the color Treasure. I actually own a Pacifica eyeshadow palette and I love the texture and the quality of those shadows so I'm sure I'm gonna love this one. First off, the packaging is to die for. The swirls, can you guys see that? The swirls kind of line up here. I like that. Okay, so this one is actually glued to the bottom. It has like that little sticky glue. I'm gonna pull that off, I hate that. So Pacifica is cruelty free, which is nice. It has it on the back of it. And 100% vegan, that's kind of nice. So this color looks like a beautiful gold. Can you guys see that? But it's really the texture, oh my god, it's so silky. I love these shadows because of their silkiness and wait till you guys see this swatch. Oh, it's really pretty. Really, really pretty. So overall, this month was obviously a lot of makeup. There was two eyeshadows and a makeup brush. I like the lip balm. I love the eye, eye cream. I'm really excited to try that. The brush was a good deal. And then two eyeshadows that actually would work really nicely together. So overall, this month for Ipsy is really, really awesome. I really, really enjoyed my box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. At the end of January, probably the first week of February, I'm going to have up a huge subscription box breakdown because I still have to do my boxy charm for this month and my glossy box for this month. Yeah, I've only filled my Pop Sugar so far and my Beauty Box 5. And I really wanna do a complete roundup of all of the Beauty Boxes I receive for you guys so that you guys can see everything that's out there and make your decision. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I also have a huge giveaway going on. I will link it right here and I will also put the link down below. It's almost over, so go and enter that because I'm giving away 15 goodie bags of makeup. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next one. Bye. First kiss just like a drug under your influence. Send me over your the magic in my veins. This must be love. Boom,